Haley Baldwin just shade Selena Gomez. We'll tell you what's going on and why fans think Selena's new song is about Justin Bieber. I'm Jane and you're watching The Daily Report. Happy Wednesday. Selena Gomez has been through a lot since her last album release in 2015. From super public breakups with The Weeknd and Justin Bieber to a freaking kidney transplant. She's pretty much stayed out of the spotlight for the whole last year, working on herself and helping others. But back in June, she dropped some big news. There's a new album coming! She told Jimmy Fallon, quote, It took me four years now to even feel at a good place with this album. And it's just because I've had such huge moments that happened in my life personally that it was like, how was I going to capture that and how was I actually going to feel good about what I was saying? So I kept going and I'm relieved now. We were getting subtle hints on our Insta this past week at some new material from Cell. And at midnight last night, we got a sneak peek at what this album could be when she released the first song titled, Lose You To Love Me. It's a self-love ballad, and apparently Selena was inspired by many things that have happened to her since her last album release. She said, quote, I thought it was important to share the music, as I know many can relate to the fact that the road to self-discovery generally comes through the scars in one's life. I want people to feel hope and to know you will come out the other side stronger and a better version of yourself. Some fans are convinced the song is about her breakup with Justin. And at first, you're like, maybe, lose you to love me, that could make sense. But then you hear these lyrics, quote, in two months you replaced us, like it was easy, made me think I deserved it, in the thick of healing. And you're like, okay, that timeline adds up. <laughs> if you recall, in March of 2018, a source close to Justin told people he and Selena weren't getting along and they decided to take a break. In June, it was reported Justin and Haley Baldwin reconnected and the two were engaged by July. So with Selena pretty obviously calling out the fact that leaving Justin was what she needed to heal, I guess this might not sit well with his new wife, Haley Bieber. After the song was posted, Haley decided to post on her Instagram story a song she was listening to called, quote, I'll Kill You, which is either super unfortunate timing or possibly a veiled threat to your husband's ex. Cute. This song by Summer Walker had lyrics like, quote, Don't want no problems. I wish a would. Try to come between us. It won't end up good. You know I love you like no one else could. I'd go to hell and back for you. And it really does fit the situation just a little too well to be a coincidence, right? <laughs> Many noticed this shade being thrown at Selena and took to Twitter to defend her, tweeting things like, quote, Haley is married with a man and still insecure about Selena. She really felt that. Hashtag lose you to love me. And quote, Haley married this guy two months after he took Selena to his dad's wedding. And now she's pressed that Selena released a song closing the chapter. Um, okay, hon. We don't know if the shade was on purpose or if it was shade at all, but we're glad that Selena is feeling herself and releasing new music. And now we want to know what you guys think. Are you excited for the new album? Let us know in the comments down below. Thank you guys so much for subscribing to the Awesomest TV Daily Report channel. I'm Jane, and honestly, that was shade.